Hello everyone, today we are going to have a look at Linux Mint 18.2 Sonia. This is the KDE 64-bit beta version. So once you have the Linux package installed, you will get this welcome screen. It has new features, documentation, apps, drivers, forums, chat room, getting involved and donations. Uh, let's check the start menu of this Linux version. So first of all, we note that the look is like a Windows 10, which is really nice. I like it. Got here at the bottom applications, computer, history and leave. So let's go back to favorite. Here we have our file manager, which is the Dolphin file manager. Here we can do all our file operations, which is really nice. The next thing we note is the web browser. This is the classical Mozilla Firefox web browser. This one here is version 54, 64 bit, which is really nice also. And the next thing we note is the personal information manager. This program has all in one, all kinds of programs, summary, a mail client, contacts, calendar, to-do list, journal, pop-up notes. So that you can see at one glimpse what you need to do. So upcoming events, pending to-dos, special dates, messages and pop-up notes. So it's a nice combination of all the programs. Here we have a terminal. This is our classical terminal where we can type in commands to do specific tasks. For example, show a list of all the files. Let's type in exit to close that. Then we note the install new applications software. Enter your extremely secure password. Here we can install any package which we search from the menu here. Let's say you search something about snapshot. We'll find all the snapshot programs. All right, moving to the next one is system settings. Here we can set all kinds of configuration settings for your computer. For example, display and monitor, display settings, resolution, compositor settings, the gamma settings, the grayscale settings, everything is there. The second session is the applications session. Here we have graphics, GIMP, ScanLight, GWAN View, Digicam and Snapshot, which we installed separately. We got the internet option here, KTorrent, Conversation, the Gmail client and the Firefox. And we got a multimedia session, audio player, disc burning, media player and a video player. We got an office pitch. So it's already pre-installed, LibreOffice. It's got a word processor, spreadsheet, presentation. Well, everything is there. In the settings we have, for example, we can configure a firewall, which is also nice. And in the system, we have all kinds of system tools. For example, a system monitor. This is like a task manager where we can see all the file names which are active in memory. 
and let's say if a program hangs you can end the task and end that process perfect so moving to the next session is computer here we can run command system settings home network root trash and uh, this removable storage which in this case is our iso we got the history section and the leave button let's say you want to reboot the system just press here and then you can click reboot if for example you wanted not to reboot you wanted to shut down you can also choose to shut down you got 30 seconds to do that or you can completely also cancel this and go back where you were at the top we notice here also this option show desktop add widgets activities lock widgets configure desktop lock screen and leave and at the right side we also have the widget settings button and we can also do some panel settings here which is really nice we got a system tray option and most recent device will appear here update manager networks instant messaging clipboard contents audio volume and also status and notifications all right this video was just to give you a quick idea of what linux mint 18.2 beta version is all about you could try to download the iso and to install it onto a virtual machine if you like this video then hit the thumbs up if you don't like this video you can hit the thumbs down and if you would like to subscribe to my channel please feel free to do so later i'm going to upload more videos for now stay well peace out Thank <music> you.